Suga Caroliniana, the Carolina hemlock in the Pinaceae or pine family. Although it's one of the lesser known conifers in the eastern United States, a lot of people feel it's actually a more beautiful version of what is more commonly known, the eastern hemlock, Suga canadensis. It does look like a hemlock. The needles are very short, they're dark green on the top, and when you turn them over, the undersides have those bright white stomatal bands similar to the eastern hemlock. The big difference between the two species, though, is that eastern hemlock needles are very sh flattened, and they're actually shorter than the needles on Suga caroliniana. These needles are not only longer, but they're also more radially aligned along the twig. They're not as flattened on one planar surface. The cones are also much larger for eastern, on the Carolina hemlock versus the eastern hemlock, about twice the size for Carolina hemlock, and they're much more open at maturity. The trees get to be very large and very old, like the eastern hemlock, living at least 500 years. And the bark has a similar appearance to the eastern hemlock, except it has a decidedly more silvery color throughout the ridges. And when you cut into it, like all hemlocks, you get a very distinct purple streaking. It's a very dense shade that's created by the Carolina hemlock, and it does get to be a very large tree. It does suffer from the hemlock woolly adelgia, which is also killing the eastern hemlock. But other than that, it's a really beautiful landscape tree. Suga caroliniana, the Carolina hemlock.